Hello everybody, my name is Dandifying, and welcome to Resident Evil. It is October, friends. It's the spooky month, so I decided, hey, it's about time I played some scary games. So, Resident Evil, I've actually never played this one. I've played the Resident Evil 2 remake. I've played Resident Evil 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So... Resident Evil. I'm actually really pumped. I'm super excited. I think that's all, but... Question. How do you like your games? Hmm. Like climbing a mountain. Fulfilling but takes a lot of work. Like going on a hike. Good exercise but not too strenuous. Like taking a walk. You can relax and enjoy yourself. I'm guessing this is difficulty. Whatever is normal, so maybe... That one approved. Oh my god, is that Chris? Jesus, he looks super young. And there's Jill. Okay. And then BSAA. Ah, oh, it's like they're different skins. Okay, I think that's what they looked like in Resident Evil 5, I'm pretty sure. We're gonna play as Jill, I mean, obviously. But we'll, we'll do the classic. Jill Valentine. I'm super pumped. I hope you guys are pumped for Halloween too. I might play a couple spooky games, so. July 1998. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their is mission. Found it yet? No, not yet, right? Our pre rendered cutscenes. cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about 10 people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Poor Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. this way. Damn it! Make for that mansion! Enter the survival horror. Can do. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. 
What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Whisker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp. <clears throat> A dining room. Are we finally playing? Okay. Oh boy. That fixed camera. I don't think I've ever played a game with a fixed camera before. This will be different. Alright, I'm gonna start pushing all the buttons and seeing what it all does. Mansion. This is a typewriter apparently. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh dear. That's right. You can't walk around and shoot. Can I have this though? Ink ribbon for typewriter. Will you take the ink ribbon? Uh, yeah, sure. Wait, how do, how do... Okay, so that brings up the menu. I like the little heart rate monitor in my face. Probably cuts it off a little bit, but... Good to know. I've got a knife. Do I have any files? Stars manual. Stars manual. These instructions are based on the default control scheme. Oh, press Y. Oh, these are just controls? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Please bear with me while I learn the game. You have not attained a map, only the places you have explored will be displayed. Oh, okay. Sure. Kinda like Resident Evil 2. I think I know most of this. When there's a movable object, face the object in the direction you want to push it and press that in the direction you are facing. I'll try to remember. Walk up to an object that's waist high of the character and then press A. You can climb on movable objects as well to climb down for them. Press A. La, 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 la. Okay. Yeah, I know how to attack. Oh, yeah. Sure. You know what? That's fine. Oh, gosh. Cool beans. Uh, exit. And a typewriter. It's an old typewriter. You're not wrong. You can save your progress. Use the ink ribbon. Don't tell me I have a number of saves. I might have like a number of saves. Oh. That could be rough, but we'll see. I think you'd better take a look at this. What is it? Don't eat it. Blood. Also, was Wesker wearing sunglasses yeah. once nighttime? <laughs> see if you can find any other clues. Don't get me wrong, Don't he looks cool. This. Let's just weird. hope it's not Chris's. Okay. Also, this looks pretty good, by the way. Like, it looks really, really good. I think on the title screen, it was said 1996. So it was like, oh. Okay, I'm gonna need to get used to the fixed camera thing. Y you good, Barry? I remember you could play as Barry in... What was that extra thing called? Oh, wow. Oh, that's really spooky. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Is that mercenaries? I think that's what it's called, mercenaries. I think if it's red, it, maybe it's locked, so... It's locked from the other side. Okay. I should have been paying attention to what Barry said. An emblem of armor is carved into the lock. Okay. Oh dear. <laughs> Wow. Oh, okay, that turns me around. Gotcha. It is also locked. An emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. So this is all a dead end. Okay, maybe I should go back <laughs> and investigate. Good lord. I know one, one horror game or franchise I've been wanting to try is Silent Hill, but I... 
It's hard to get a physical copy of those these days. That also has fixed camera. Hi. Hello. Oh, oh, sweet Jesus. <laughs> um. Well, time to practice my aiming. How does one? Oh, I have to do like that. I gotcha. Oh, oh, that's a little awkward. Oh dear. Oh dear. I'll get used to it eventually. Oh, that's rough. <laughs> Having the fixed camera. Oh wow. Okay. Maybe I should kill him. I'll try killing him. If he. Okay. Can I shoot him in the head? I'm like trying to aim up, but it's not quite <laughs> doing it. I'll just keep trying to shoot him. Is he actually? I guess he's actually. Oh, 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 okay, never mind. I'll see what he was hiding though. Hello? Oh. Uh, better report back to Wesker. Oh yeah, that you saw his arm's arm? Yeah, sure. Oh shit. I kind of figure that with this game, it's more survival horror than action horror, so maybe I don't Sorry. need to what is it? fire my gun Look so out. much. It's a monster. Let me take care of it. Shoot in the face. What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Yeah, we better. Also, okay. Oh, oh. Will you take the emblem? Yes. I was gonna say, wasn't there something? I oh, okay. Yeah. From the status screen, select an item and then select the examine command. Sure. Yeah. Sure. It, lo it looks nice. Check. It's gold all around the outer edges due to frequent fitting. Do I need to do anything with it? There's nothing unusual. Well, I'll keep in mind that it's there. Also, can I like reload? No. Do I have infinite ammo? I don't think I have infinite ammo. It's a gun. <laughs> That's all you need to know. It's a gun. Okay. You want to go now, Barry? Can I like, examine everything? Oh, okay. Maybe I should try to examine more things. A picture of two knights striking each other. The short sword has been thrust into the breast of one knight. Or the long sword has pierced the head of the other. It's kind of messed up, huh? When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. Maybe that's something I need to look at later. Should I go examine that? <laughs> I guess the zombie was coming over. Wesker, take your glasses off. Wesker! Or is he missing too? Jill, help me look for him, but let's not leave this hall. Good idea. Okay. Map? Oh yeah. So it does circle the typewriter. I'll remember that it's there and I'll make sure to save when I can. I'm guessing this is not gonna open. Better finish searching the hall first. Okay. Alright, you can go back here. But the fixed camera is like throwing me off so much. Yeah, that's okay. I just want to see what's back here. Oh, is that it? Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room. That's a good idea. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. 
Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make better use of it. Thanks. You got the lockpick. Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Okay, I'll probably never see you again. Sure, so... When should I save my game, I wonder? Well, I'm okay right now, so maybe I'll just... Look around? Do I want to do that? I kind of want to save my game now, just in case, because I've already been playing for like 15 minutes. There's something in there. Oh, that music is freaking good. It's creepy. Women drawing water. A portrait hangs on the wall. It almost seems like it's watching you. Don't say that. I'm gonna go save, just in case. So I think I have three ink things. I'll at least use it once. Oh, wow, you only have a limited numbers, number of saves. That's kind of rough. It's alright though. Alright, let's do it. Yes, please. Yeah. Match in dining room. Save six as well. Thanks. Okay. And if I look at that. Okay, so it definitely uses up an ink ribbon. Okay. Good to know. Uh, I guess for now, we're just gonna have to look around. I imagine I'm gonna find a bunch of things to open these other doors. So I'll go this way first. Because why not? Also, can I, like, break stuff open? Yeah, can I, like... Equip. How does this work? Because I know like in other Resident Evil games you can like break open like pots and things. But I don't know if that's so advanced for this one. Maybe not. I'll try to keep an eye out though. Alright, let's try this one. I've also contemplated playing Resident Evil 4 again. I haven't played it on the channel before. But that was my first horror game. Portraits and photographs decorate the wall. It looks like they could come to life at any moment. <laughs> That's right. Ah, uh, okay. Is this the thing where I, like, need to push it? Okay. Oh, this is a door. It's locked. An emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. Of course it is. So... Hang on. Uh, just look around. Oh. An eerie picture of the mansion. Oh, this is actually getting kind of creepy. Will you take the dagger? Sure, why not? Using defensive items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy. When grabbed by an enemy. However, you will not be able to escape when the enemy grabs you from behind. To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen and then select an item from the defense item menu and select the equip command. If your defensive item mode is set to manual in the controller setting, you must press left button to use... Oh, sorry, left trigger. To use the defensive item. Sure. LB. Left bumper. Oh yeah? It says it's equipped. I guess it was doing it automatically. I was gonna say, you're gonna give me an opportunity to use it now. <laughs> oh. Yikes. Oh. Shoot him in the face. Shoot him in the face. Shoot him in the face. Uh. Oh, yeah, there we go. That'll do it. Okay, uh, fuck you. He's not dead. <laughs> He's definitely not dead. Okay, uh. I still want to get this, though. Um, what I'm doing is I'm going to see if this will reset where the... Oh my god, I can't even think of... A sentence, I can't talk. Reset the drawer so I can push it. Will this also reset the zombie? It might. Hello? Yeah, okay. Can I, like, jump over it? And then go in here? No. I'm sure I'll figure this out. 
sometime. Oh yeah, there he is. I'm guessing he's stuck there, though. Let's so check something. Okay, I do only have four bullets left. I'll try to be more mindful of ammo. Try. As I, like, shoot blindly everywhere. Alright, uh, let's try another door. Sure is. An emblem of a helmet is carved into the lock. How about upstairs? No, it's funny. So, I did mention that I've played Resident Evil 5 before. That's a door? Oh, okay. Um, I mentioned that I've played Resident Evil 5 before. And, is this outside? Uh, there's there was a DLC for that game and in that DLC you actually go back to this pension So it's not my first time seeing this place oh. Let me guess. Yeah Can you like lock pick it? What's this locked from the other side? Hmm. That's not something I can just like Use it's not necessary to use this now. Okay. I'll figure that out later. I don't think I want to be out here, do I? Oh. A tomb engraved with a picture of an angel. There's an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. Okay. Oh god. The fixed camera thing is a lot spookier. That's for damn sure. Is that Emma? Will you take the- oh fuck yeah I will. If I can find a shotgun. All right, well, I- oh my gosh. I don't think I'm doing much out here. All right, I'll go back inside, because outside is a lot scarier. Yikes. Also zombie dogs. In the opening scene? No thanks. I think they're the worst than the actual zombies. All right, I think I'm above the dining hall. Thought I heard somebody. There's something in this woman's hand. The statue. Nope. Thanks. I'm just gonna see. Yeah, all these doors are locked, but I better just examine them anyway. Not from the other side. It's locked. An emblem of a sword is carved into the lock. Sure thing. Yeah, she's. It's. There's a gem, clearly. Stained glass window. The pattern in the center resembles a woman. Sure thing. Can I have that, by the way? No. God dang it. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, you're pushing it. Okay. Do you actually want me to push it down? I wonder if I can jump down from here. No, I can't. That's okay. Okay. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm not gonna waste my ammo, because I don't have any. Can't waste ammo if you don't have any. I guess I did something good? Maybe. Okay. And this is gonna be locked too, huh? Locked from the other side. Alright, I'll go back the other way. Oh god. And this would be locked. I just wanna see what they're locked with. Is that one's sword? So it seems like the sword is the way to go, huh? That one's armor. An oil painting in a large frame. The paint is dried and cracked. Oh, oh god, this is my reflection, what the hell? You can't make anything out through the darkness and fog. 
It's been well preserved and the people in it are still vividly depicted. All right, uh, go back. Surely I need to do something with this thing that I got on the wall, I would assume. Let's just go down this way. I'll pick up whatever it is I dropped. That won't save. Oh yeah, give it to you. Will you take the blue gemstone? Why not? Imagine there'll be like storage at some point as well. All right. There's an indentation where the emblem used to be. You're not wrong. Okay. Uh, surely I have to do something with this. Let me just examine it. It looks like something can come out. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just see if I can like use it anywhere. Oh god. Oh god. Why are you just standing there? Jesus, what the hell? <sighs> I'll go this way. It's creepy, he's just standing there doing nothing. Okay, have, have I not been here? I don't think so. Oh, wow, that's a good cinematic shot right there. Oh yeah, of course. How much was that? 15? Let's see if I can like... Okay. You can reload. Good. Oh, we got all 15 bullets, that's pretty nice. Oh god, that thing is gonna get up for sure. You can't tell me otherwise. Oh, okay. This has herbs. You can't carry any more items. Alright, we'll leave it there, and I'll remember that it's there. You getting up? There's a corpse collapsed on the floor like it was an instant death. What the hell happened in this mansion? Do we even want to know? All right, go up the stairs. Oh, oh, oh God. Up you get. There you go. Sorry, Gabra. This is sp I kind of love the simplicity of it. Oh, it's a long hallway. Okay. No. That's a lot of herbs on the ground. <laughs> Give me a storage chest. I mean, all these other doors are locked, so I might as well just explore here first, right? There's an inscription on the shield. Death is only the beginning. Isn't that what they say in... What movie was that? Uh-oh. That can't be a good thing. Um, may whoever takes this emblem find peace and death. He can't carry any more items. Okay. Well, obviously this thing is gonna move, right? If I take it. A peculiar. Okay. And I'll see if I could put my stuff somewhere. There must be a storage chest. I don't want to die instantly, right? Who does? Hey, guy. Stay there, please. Oh, fuck. No. Uh... What happens if I- I'm just gonna see what happens if I, like, go out of the room and go in. Does it, like, reset the zombie at all, or...? Gotta experiment and figure stuff out. Nice if I could just run past you. 
Locked. That's where I came from. You're just there, I can see you in the mirror. Oh, that's handy. Hmm. Maybe I'll see if I can just drop something on the ground and I'll pick up this key. No. Damn, what should I do? Um. All right, I've looked around and I couldn't find any sort of storage chest. So what I might just have to do is I'll do that. I know it's kind of a waste, um, but I'll just try to be more mindful of, I guess, um, what do you call it? Item management? Did I ever go back here? Oh. Oh yeah, it would be, okay. Let's pick this up, see what happens. Yep, maybe whoever takes us to the... really just dead? <laughs> wow, maybe I'm really just dead here, huh? Wow. Well, death. I don't know what I expected. Okay, so I need to do something there. Maybe I could like, I don't know, get used to it, achieve it. You are dead. Okay, I kind of figured that would happen, but... Hmm. Wait, so does this mean I have to load up a previous save? Or is there like checkpoints? Oh, I have to load up a previous save. That's okay, because that means I can manage my inventory a bit better and not be a silly, silly bitch. Okay. Uh, in the darkness lies your fears. Oh yeah, so now I have to do this again. <laughs> That's fine. I don't mind that. Um... I don't remember what I have and haven't done though. Oh, okay, I need to push that thing and get the gem again. Maybe I'll do that later. I'll try maybe doing this little puzzle thing first. Maybe. Oh, seriously? Oh, okay. It's the film that belongs to Kenneth. I need a video player to see what's recorded on it. Oh. Yeah, no, you're noisy. Maybe that was like a key item. Oh. Okay, I better just start examining everything. I don't think I could do this little puzzle thing though, so maybe for now, I should just like look around. Just be nice and thorough. Oh, um, I'll, I'll try not to pick up everything. Oh. Oh, that's why that was there. I know he's there. I know there's some cool herbs. Yeah, I think for now it's just do a lot of exploring. A large bird cage. There's a dead raven inside. That's good to know. Yeah, maybe I'm like going about this the wrong way. That you know, take your time, explore a lot, examine everything, manage your inventory. It's learning though. It's a learning experience. Hello. So I examine you. What was this way again? Uh. A bunch of locked doors, and probably a guy, yeah. Leave him there. Yeah, I'll just like look around, because maybe there's something in here that I need to do this, you know? Because obviously if I just take this thing, it's gonna trigger this, which is, which go figure. Makes a lot of sense. Yeah. There's a description on the shield, yep, yeah. you're gonna kill me. That was obvious, I won't touch you. Shame that there wasn't an option to put it back, huh? Death is everything. I mean, it happens to everything. And that's locked, okay. Yeah, I'll just look around a lot and examine everything. And I won't touch that until I'm confident that, hey, I'm probably not gonna die if I take it. Or is that too much to ask? All right, uh, where else have I been? I guess I better do the thing and Push that statue down again. Hmm? Give me that gemstone. Oh, hey. Just. 
that good enough for you? Uh oh. There is a map of the mansion 1F. Take it. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, this place is huge. Wow. That helps a little bit, sure. Oh. Thank you. That's really useful. I'm still not really sure where I need to go, but that's okay. I'll figure it out. Wow, I can't believe I'm lost already. Oh shit, fuck. <laughs> wow, that really just- okay, that's fine too. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Wow. Oh, there's ammo too. Yeah. Thanks. Is there anything back here? I'm guessing this is locked. Uh, they're both gonna be locked. Locked on the other side, quickly. Oh, I locked it? Oh. I'm a silly goof. I thought, because this area had all locked doors, when I looked at the map, it's like, oh, it's all red and it's all locked. And so I figured, oh, okay, maybe don't go that way until I find, like, a key, but no. That was a stupid mistake. Okay. Now I'm not lost anymore. Oh, hi. Good. Okay. So I got an arrowhead. I think I know where that goes, actually. Oh, okay. I made a mistake. I can admit that. Just look everywhere from now on. Even if it looks like it's all locked. See, I'm learning. Uh, do I need to examine this thing? Because I'm guessing this goes into the tomb. Yeah. Like, do I take, like, the head out? And the arrowhead looks like it can be removed. There we go. The arrowhead is made from peridot, sometimes referred to as a poor man's emerald. Yay, I'm doing it, guys. I did it. Wow. Get reload. And go outside. Okay, I know where this one goes, at least. Wow. Learning things. I've learned a lot already. Okay. Oh, I know there's shotgun. Oh, jumping frames a little. I know there's shotgun ammo out here, so maybe I'll just leave it on the ground due to my inventory being real full. Oh, well. Yes, so put it in. Do I need to do like that? Okay. Yay, I did it. Give me some kind of storage chest, please. Ah. This thing tells you I'm gonna get, a, get lost a lot in this game, but maybe that's the point. A stone statue with a hole where the eyes should be. A stone statue with holes where the eyes, nose, and mouth should be. What is this puzzle? A statue with a hole where the nose should be. A stone statue with a hole where the mouth should be. What on earth? <laughs> okay. The chain is moving. Where could it lead? The book is fitted perfectly in the indentation. Oh no. Will you take the book of curses? No, hang on, before I take it. Let me look around. Is something terrible gonna happen to me? Maybe. You know what? Just freaking take it and see what happens. It'll be amusing if I die again. I was, I was thinking that thing was gonna like slam down and like hit me. It's titled Book of Curses. You're not wrong. Why is it titled that? Oh, it's a key. Will you remove it? Of course I will. You got the mansion key. Okay. Oh, I can open it. Do I want to look at this? Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. A mask that sees no evil. A mask that cannot speak, smell. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken. Sus. Okay. Mansion key. Savage it. 
Okay. Ah, it's got the engraving of a sword on it. Okay, good to know. Okay, look at everything. Look at everything. Yes. Progress! Am I gonna get attacked anytime soon? I'm just like waiting for things to spawn. Hello? No? Okay, keep it that way. Oh, actually, this might. Oh, uh, I think that was locked from the other side, so I'll go back. Did it. Also, I really want to save my game, but it's like. Oh. Limited saves. Okay, uh. I'll see if I can open any of these. Oh, okay, I locked on the other side. That's more than fine. Maybe go this way. Oh, so this magic is pretty dope. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's spooky. Oh, can I interact with that? It's locked. An emblem of armor is engraved. Wow, you really need a lot of keys for this, huh? Will you take the wooden mount? Maybe just leave it there for now, because I don't have that much room in my inventory. I'll just remember that it's there. Mount. What I need a mount for. Oh. That's nice. Oh, some more ammo? I wonder how much I can hold in... Oh, I'll just take it. Will you take the, the dog whistle? Okay. And some more ammo. Maybe just leave it there for now. It's good to know that it's here, don't get me wrong. Botany, uses of medicinal herbs. It's a well-known fact that there exist many plants that are credited with medicinal healing healing powers. Since ancient times, man mankind has been healing wounds and diseases using various plants. In this book, we will sample three herbs that are a native of the Arklay Mountains and briefly outline each of their medicinal qualities. Each herb has a distinct color and a distinct me medicinal quality. I'm just talking about the green herbs, I guess. The green herb recovers physical strength. The blue herb neutralizes natural toxins. However, the red herb has no real effect by itself. We have found that mixing green and red herbs results in a magnified effect. We will outline the effects of red herbs when mixed with other herbs when we have more data. Meanwhile, feel free to experiment on your own, for true knowledge is only acquired through experience. Blue herbs, huh? I don't think I've experienced blue herbs before. Weird. A lighter. Leave it there for now. It's a lot of stuff. How long it takes to piece everything together here. It's Oh shit, it's really like a frickin' puzzle. Jesus fuck. Jesus fuck. Fuck me. Ugh. You're just so quiet and you peer out of nowhere. <laughs> fuck me. <sighs> Roger. Oh, that's a lot of weed. I know what to do with it at least. Oh yeah. It's good to know it's there, don't get me wrong. That looks like a map of the area. An unlit fireplace. Okay. It's locked. An emblem of a helmet. Okay. I guess I can use the lighter on that. Uh, I'll leave that stuff there because I only have one slot in my inventory left. Maybe I should go save. Should I go save? No, I won't go save yet. Just do lots of exploring first. Yeah. Okay. You here, guy? Yeah, you are. Uh. Uh. Okay. Oh shit! Fuck. Jesus. Try to see if I can like juke him. Well, at least they're not fast. I'll see if I can run around him. If not, I don't mind taking a hit. 
Come on. Come on over, shambles. No. Ugh. Oh god. Oh god, camera. Or I can just try shooting him. That works too. Oh yes, I did it. I did it. I did it. That's efficiency right there. <laughs> okay, got a herb. Uh, what's here? Oh, typewriter. Ooh, please be there. So it's like, yes! Storage. Storage. Special instructions for the disposal of dead bodies. You have new information regarding those beings. They may appear to be dead, but in fact they are able to come back to life. However, there are ways to prevent them from becoming active again. Currently, there are two known methods to cease their resurrection. One is incineration, two, destruction of the head. If further methods are discovered, you will be notified immediately. Meanwhile, to those of you who still have the will to live, oil has been placed on the first floor of the mansion. Take as much as you need. You'll need something to light it with, which you will need to find by yourself. I did find the lighter. Oil has been placed in the first floor of the... Oh, okay. Let me like douse him in oil, then light him up. That would be kind of cool. Flask. Will you take the fuel canteen? Sure? Oh, I guess to put the oil in, that would make some sense. There's still plenty of kerosene left. Sure? That sounds a little too fun. Okay, there's a lantern lying on top of the supplies. The warm light makes you relax. Storage chest. Good. What should I put in there, though? I feel like I'm not going to use the knife much. Maybe... Like that? Oh, oh I see. Oh, and there's first aid spray. Right on. Well, obviously I need the key. Maybe put the gem away. And the emblem? Because I don't know what to do with that yet. Oh. Oh, leave that there. So I've got a little bit more space now. So how would this work? Hmm. It would be fun to light some zombies up, I'm not gonna lie. Okay guys, uh, I think it's actually break time, friends, so why don't we stop it here for now? I probably should save, so yes, I will save. There we go, I'll try to be mindful of how many saves I have and, and all that, um, and I'll try to be efficient with it, but wow, good start so far. I already felt kind of lost at first, but then I kind of realized, hey, just look around. Take your time, look around, examine everything, and you'll find it. And this is really cool. I actually really like the pacing of this, and it's super creepy. It's fun. This is really fun. So I hope you guys have been enjoying it too. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please consider subscribing to the channel and liking the video. I really appreciate the support. I'm on a few different social media platforms. The links are in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.